What is up, guys? Welcome to a brand new series of The Sims 4 Werewolves. If you guys don't already know me, I'm bringing the party, the host of this series. I really appreciate everyone being here. I'm going to be having a full playthrough of the entire pack coming out every day over the next couple week or so it is a game pack these usually take me around 10 episodes or so so you can expect that until we complete the all aspects of the game pack uh we're gonna be going specifically through werewolves and they did add a new lifetime wish so it kind of gives you i feel like a lot of the packs which i don't personally like but it's how they do it a lot of the game packs that add lifetime wishes you kind of achieve everything in the game pack by going through the lifetime wish if that makes sense so like universities they added a lifetime wish it was get an a and graduate with a college degree it got you everything you needed for that they also added like a travel one for one of the snow packs so like it was yeah all these actually city living city native it gave you everything within city living um the strangerville took you through the strangerville pack so i'm going to assume that this werewolf one will take me through the werewolves. It is an assumption, but it is a what I think a very good assumption. Anyways, so now that we kind of got all that uh, all that laundry, all that background stuff done, my boy right here is Lance. He's wearing a lot of the new clothes that came with the pack. I like the pack's clothes, to be honest. They it's pretty grunge and just kind of ripped up and dirty and layered and i really like that it's a look that i feel like the sims never really like look at i actually think i might wear this also really reminds me of twilight which i guess if you're a big twilight fan maybe you'd like this pack i gotta be honest i never watched a lot of twilight in my day but um i did see the first and second one with a with a lady back in the day i gotta i'll shoot you straight i did but i can't say i enjoyed it but I also can't say I did not enjoy it, okay? It wasn't half bad. It wasn't bad. It wasn't bad. At the time, it was... I was young and a little naive. Anyways, <laughs> this isn't about my Twilight watching or not watching of Twilight. We are here. We're going to hop on into this. Uh, the Werewolf Pack also added a couple other things. So, like, you got your bracelets. You got some, like, hand wraps. Uh, you got new nails, which I guess is kind of cool if that's your cup of tea. Uh, some cool rings and stuff. I actually really like the bracelets, but not too important. The hairdos are, I swear, is this not what, uh, is it Josh Hutchins? No, not Josh Hutchinson. That's, that's, uh, that's, that's Hunger Games. Uh, not Edward Cullen. The other one. Is his name Josh the Werewolf? Whatever. Didn't he have this long hair, long luscious hair? I don't like it. And then I also really hate the mullet. Was this supposed to be a mullet? I think it's hideous. I got to be honest. But I think it just might be my fashion sense. Uh, and I ain't got a lot of fashion sense. So, so not much to say there. I hate it. But I think we're just going to do it to have it part of the pack. Yeah, they didn't give me like anything else to pick from. I wish they gave me like a, a wolf mask or something. So I didn't have to pick this silly hairdo. Uh, right now he's wearing glasses. I actually hate the glasses too. And I don't think the glasses are part of the pack. So I, I think we can... Uh, veto those bad boys. Uh, where is that? Where are the glasses? Yeah, can we just take those bad boys off? And you need some brows, man. I am a man with a nice set of brows. They are thick and luxurious. There is just so much room in my brows. And this guy doesn't look anything like me. He can grow facial hair. I cannot. That's step one in why this guy doesn't look anything like me. Step two is a lack of eyebrows. I swear you look at my face, all you see are eyebrows. That's good enough for me. He's a very average looking fellow, but he's in shape. And I would imagine a werewolf being in shape. I don't know. Uh, I think a werewolf would freaking kick my butt. But then I imagine a vampire being skinny. I imagine a werewolf, very buff. Vampire, very skinny. No idea why. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, cool. So here's my vampire vampire whoa here's my werewolf i actually have an entire series of the vampire pack mind you um i do have one of those it was from like 2018 day four was doing daily uploads and stuff okay cool this is my guy we're just gonna move him in um nothing else matters let's do it that's just, his name's wolf by the way of course you know wolf he's a werewolf his name's wolf his lifetime wish is the wolf thing he's active ambitious and creative it's the traits I always pick. They're good traits. They they work well. Everyone's happy with those traits usually. And it sometimes helps towards a lifetime wish. I don't know. 
But if you guys are, oh, I didn't even say this. I'm supposed to say this right at the start. If you guys are watching this day one, thank you guys so much for having the notifications on. If you guys are watching this after day one, in the description will be a link to the playlist. You guys can just click on that bad boy and it'll let you watch the entire series. Like it'll play through all of it. So do that if you guys want to watch it all. And we're going to move into this town, I guess. Dang it. Dang it. There's not a house here. I did not. Oh, wait. Yep. Starter home. Moon shack. Take you to the moon shack. Moon shack. Love shack, baby. Sorry. I think the name of that song is actually Love Shack. This is the moon shack. Cool. So we have Lance Wolf hopping on into the moon shack. Got to be honest. I haven't played Sims in probably six plus months. So I am excited to be back. Sims 4 has been a bittersweet game for me. I keep hoping for the next iteration of Sims, and it's not because I dislike Sims 4. I just think it's done. Like, I think everything that needs to be in this game, at my opinion, is more or less in this game. So I think it's... I'm ready to move forward with my life and kind of hop into Sims 5. I'm really excited to see what it happens. Become a werewolf. How does one become? No fangs or fur to be found. Try spending some time around werewolves, either friend or foe, or explore the deep, dark reaches of moon... Wood mills underground. Level up to runt. Experience a full moon. Read a werewolf book. So I think step number one will be heading. What what time of the day? It's 8 a.m. I'm full statted up. Let's go over into the deep dark reaches of moon wood mills underground. And I think so. I haven't watched. <laughs> gotta be honest, guys. I have not watched any gameplay of this. I know. It's it's a hit or miss on watching any gameplay. It's like, hey, gameplay, you should watch it to be prepared for the pack. But I'm also like, I don't want to ruin the pack for myself. I'd rather experience this for the first times with you guys. I got to be honest, I think I only have watched one trailer and it wasn't even a gameplay trailer. It was just like them being werewolves and howling. And then I saw a few like depictions of, oh, he's a werewolf. I can tell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Continue. <clears throat> What an old bunker looks like. There it is. But anyways, Sims 4, I'm just ready for the next one. I'm ready for the next iteration. I think Sims 4 is a good game. And they can keep adding more, but I don't think they need to. I think they, I think it's time to say goodbyes. I think it's time to say goodbyes. And I can say that even more so as they keep adding these, like, uh, not stuff packs, the one below that, kits. As soon as I start seeing them add, like, kits a month, I'm like, okay, they are really trying to milk this. Uh, the kits should just be free at this point. It's kind of tight, but Lance just needs to squeeze through. Ouch. Lance took a full, a face full of metal from a jutting pipe. That was impossible to see in the dark. Uh -huh. Get over it. We're going to become a werewolf. But, uh, as soon as I started releasing kits as frequently as they have been, I kind of feel like they are retiring the game soon. And at this rate, like if you were to like check out two into three into four, four uh two into three and three into four had the same time period and this time period was supposed to be up like two years back like it's it's time to move on i love the game time to move on man and i will still play this game i'm not going to bat two i'm, I'm sure james would tell me to go to bat two but i will not. as lance rounds a corner in the tunnels he hears what sounds like a slight rumble or a murmur a few steps later the sounds gets clearer and scarier something is nearby growling investigate the growling we bite me bite me <laughs> batu you, you guys you guys remember james and his batu kick ah good old james man what a good dude all right cool we're in searching in silences uh lance moves forward this uh, towards the sound the growling ceases as he continues to search for whatever was making the noise his hands land his hand lands in something sticky a quick glance reveals that it's food. It looks like an abandoned snack. It's chili. You're saying they had a full bowl of chili, and not only did they have a full bowl, you're taking it home with you. You said, this chili is out here. It ain't staying in here. I need it. I'm like, come on, man. You don't need to take the chili home with you. Lance, just leave the chili. It's okay. I, while I'm here, let me just look at this. That's it? Oh no. Oh no. This is not a lifetime wish. Oh geez. Did they not add a lifetime wish with this? What am I going to, I'm going to have to do more than a lifetime wish. Clearly. I'm not going to, that's not, that's not a full playthrough. 
That's a one episoder. I could get that done in one episode if I rushed it. What am I going to do? Hey, guys, leave a comment. I don't think I'll actually have any other recorded prior to this going up. So let me know what you guys want to see out of this series. I'm a little surprised that there's not. I hate these. I hate this. I forgot they started doing that. One step. Mm. What do you get once you complete it? Uh, oh, yeah. People like you more. What's that? Whoa, weather. Current lunar phrase. New moon. Wait, are you out? Wait, what? Did you get out and just do push-ups? Wait, are you not a vamp? No, go back in there, dude. He dis- Yeah, he does dislike fit- Who the heck likes fitness? Alright, we're going back in. Dude, you're supposed to become a vamp- A werewolf. A wet dog? The tunnel's damp. Can't seem to smell a wet dog. Ooh, hold up. That could be our werewolf friend. That could be him. Leaving uh, must be the exit. Oh, go back in, dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. Lifestyle capped. I don't. Uh, lost forward in the tunnel. Very dark. And uh, he's hopelessly lost. All right. Doesn't matter. Find a werewolf. Maybe we'll just befriend a werewolf, I guess. Drip, drip, drip. In the back of his mind, Lance can hear a faint and steady dripping sound. It becomes becoming more clear. The tunnel's many leaking pipes. Contemplate the dripping. I don't know. Does it matter? Uh, the drip offers a real sense of reassurance and familiar that familiarity. Cool. He acquired a wellness skill. What's he doing down there? No, dude. Become aware. I might have to just make friends with werewolves. I thought this was going to be a quick way to do it. You smell a wet dog. You know what that is? Werewolf. Frog city. That was actually a longer one. I probably should have read that one. Wait, chat with Jacob? Hold up, Jacob. That's that's from the that come on, you're not even trying to hide the Twilight references at this point. Elder. Does this guy look like a That's a straight werewolf. Hold up. That is that is literally not even joking, a straight werewolf. He looks like a werewolf. He is a werewolf. That is that I didn't even realize that they were that that werewolfy. This guy looks ridiculous. Gal? Guy? Lily. Gal. Gal. Ooh. Ooh. Hey. Wait. What? What are we doing? I, I just want to become a werewolf. How do I become a werewolf? Ask about werewolf packs. Let's, let's do full werewolf interaction. Ask about Moonlight Mill. I love how we just don't even, like, it, no one even cares. We're like, ah, yeah, just this hairy beast over here in my simulation video game. I I saw a lot of people hating on that, by the way. There's a lot of folks who wouldn't be where they are today uh, if it wasn't for the Moonwood Collective. Pack should be working to benefit the community, not themselves. Cool. Jacob has always made Christopher so proud. He was in danger, Christopher. Learned he's unemployed. Nah. Nah. Hey, you can contribute to the pack, but you ain't contributing to society. <laughs> like, come on, dude. Can, can we just werewolf pack? <laughs> Sorry, you have to ask our leader, Christopher. Can you introduce me to Christopher? Where's Christopher? Oh. Christopher. Get out of my way. Christopher. Wait, you're not a, you don't look like a wolf. This isn't this guy's not a wolf. Let's don't start pulling my chain. This guy's just a normal everyday fella. I'm sure he's not. Um, sorry, Lance. I don't know you well enough. Uh, let's get a chance to know each other better. Okay. Let's, let's, I'm going to learn about all the important stuff about his day, about his favorite color, about his career. Ask for a curse, but 
I wish it gave you a description of what the heck that meant. It doesn't. It's a pleasant conversation, ain't it? Dislikes the color purple. Good thing I'm not wearing anything purple. He's a freelance programmer. Programmer and werewolf all in one. Sorry, Lance. I don't know you. We'll come back to this, all right? I, I got him in my contacts. He didn't even give me his phone number, but he... He gave me his phone number. Now that I met him, I have his number. I'll give him a ring in a few, in a, in a bit. You know, I'll give him a ring. I'll invite him over. And then I'll bite him. Just kidding. Oh, invite them in. Invite the neighbors in. Is that Christopher? Hey, hey, ho, hey, ho. Anything's better than Vlad, am I right, guys? Hopefully he's not as annoying as Vlad. Hey, 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 Christopher. Oh, what a coinky dink. Yeah, I just moved in the neighborhood. Yeah. You, you just coming on by? Is that, is that the werewolf eating? What was that sound? Chat about... Maybe we shouldn't chat about property values. This thing is run down. I, I hope one day I have a house so I can chat about property values, but everyone knows on this market. All right, all right, I think we're friends now. Would you guys say we're friends? We've at least talked for five minutes. If, let me tell you, let me tell you something for anyone who doesn't know this, all right? Let me tell you something about men. This is this is an interesting fact, fact about men. We could just meet each other and talk for 10 minutes about the news, about sports. And I got news for you. We are now friends. Like, that is, that is how tough it is to be a friend between two dudes. Now it's not it's not universal. It's not it doesn't apply to everyone, but let me tell you, it's pretty easy to become a friend with a guy. And you might not actually think you're friends, but you'll say you're friends. At least that's what I've found. Like I'll meet someone at a at a, like a party and then I'll introduce them to my friends. They'll be like, "Yo, this is my bud, you know. This is my pal." Like I just met him 2 minutes ago by by the uh by the punch. And <laughs> now I'm saying he's my pal. I'm introducing him to my friends. Like, my friend just went to the bathroom. He comes back, I have a new pal. But me and Christopher, pals. That's what that's what I'm getting at here, okay? Needless to say, give him a little pep talk. Maybe that's what he needs. Hype him up, and then drop it on him that we're going to join. Thank him for coming. Dude, we've been talking so long, man. Let's, let's talk about the wolf pack. What do you think, buddy? <laughs> Sorry, I don't know you well enough. Dang it, guys. He's he's playing hardball. He didn't get the memo that once guys talk for five minutes, you're friends. What if we play a video game? I don't even own a video game. I'll have to buy a video game just to play it. How about if we invite him to snuggle? <laughs> what, what if we invite him to relax next to me in my bed? Huh? <laughs> what then? <laughs> How are we pals at that point? <laughs> I didn't even look. What were the new items I had with this pack? Hold up. Like all, they usually had like 10 of them. One of the new items. Uh, a couple desks. Ooh, fire pit. That's kind of cool. A little off the grid. A little eco footprint. New bed. Oh, toddler. Actually, that's cool, man. There's not enough toddler beds. That's cool. A little love. Is that a love seat? What is that? A little love seat. A little couch. What's this? It's just a seat, but it's tires. Man, they really ran with the uh, with the um, the Twilight kind of thing, man. Like I swear, this is so twi like the campfire in the backyard. What are they gonna have a baseball field where they all start running around and showing off their powers while playing baseball? Like, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I gotta watch it again. I gotta watch it again just so next episode I have more references for you guys. I gotta watch one more time. It's been so long. But uh, I gotta watch it again. Is it, what is this? What the heck is that? Scrap heap bar. Oh, that's a bar. Oh, that's cool. That's a little bed action. That's a little patched up bed. I do like the flowers. Like, this is very... What's coffee pot? 
I like it. It's cool. Like, they did a nice job. I'm not, like, in love with any of it. I do like that's a new stuff. Is that just a pile of junk? That's kind of sick. You guys remember in Sims 3 when there was junkyards? Does anyone remember that? Any of you guys? Anyone? Anyone remember junkyards? Junkyards were cool, I thought. I thought it was a cool, underused system. And never used again after it, you know? It was junkyards. So a junkyard, you'd be able to, like, search for junk. I don't even know. Like, what was the point of junkyards? You could dive into it, find scrap to build robots. That's what you could do. Um, it was cool. Can you invite him over? Just so we can kind of, like, speed up this, like, roommate pro- Roommate? No, 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 no. Friendship process. Uh, friendly. I'm just asking about his day again. Like, what's a man gotta do to make a friend here? Yeah, I do have to start romancing this poor guy. He literally came over to ask for a cursed bite. What if I just ask him for the cursed bite? Like, what if I don't even ask him for the thing? I just ask him for the cursed bite. I might regret this. You guys are sure gonna tell me, right? You guys will let me know in the comments. Bite me. Bite me. Is it gonna be like a neck bite? Is it gonna be another neck bite? I don't even know. Like, how do you bite someone? Doesn't know Lance well enough. Try befriending him first. Dude, we're pals, man. We've talked for like 10 minutes. Okay. I'm going down to the final straw. And you guys are gonna hate this. It's the stargaze option. It's time to get a little, little romantic, a little romantic in the in the grass, you know. Me and Christopher, Christopher and me, Lance and Christopher. Yeah. If you are not pals, if you are not friends, after a, a gorgeous stargaze together underneath the beautiful moon, nothing's gonna make you friends. All right, let's drop the question one more time. Then we're gonna call it an episode. Once again, if you guys are new to the series or new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. But also, if you guys really want to show some love, um, he said yes. I'll extend the uh, collective. Okay, we're happy to have you. Don't uh, hesitate to stop by our tree and spend some time with us or use the facilities. Though, though not required, we gladly welcome any contra contributions to better the pack. Your generosity is. Where does that even go? Oh no. Where's it go? I'm going to drag this up. Sorry, guys. I'm part of the pack. Have limited access to the pack's hangout? No, 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 no. That's it? Hold it. Bite me, man. Just do it. Just do it. My neck. Make it happen. Ah! I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Oh! Oh! Well, I think it's time to be going. Yeah, it is. All right, boys. <laughs> Thank you everyone so much for liking, commenting, and subscribing. <laughs> Leave a comment. Let you let me know what you guys want me to do. If you guys are watching this day one, uh, two or three or four, or just after the fact, in the description is a link to the playlist. Show it some love. I love the content up ASAP. But for now, y'all, thank you for the love and support. We'll talk very soon. See you, dudes.